In this video I'm going to show you how to transfer your data from an old iMac to a new iMac really quickly and easily. On the old iMac make sure you're connected to the Wi-Fi just by going to the symbol in the top right corner connect to your network. Go to your launch pad and then do a search for migration assistant and then press continue it'll ask you for your password so fill in your password and the old one is ready to go. Make sure on the new machine that you power up the keyboard and the trackpad or mouse if you've got one. Then power up the iMac. Press spacebar once you see the low screen. Then choose your language for your country. Choose your country or region. You can skip the steps if you want or you can set up accessibility if you need to. I'm going to press not now and not now. Press continue for data and privacy. And then how do you want to transfer your information from a Mac time machine backup or startup disk? Press continue. Then on the old machine, you should now see that to another Mac and these options have appeared. Click to another Mac, continue. And then you'll start to see that there's a code appears and it should appear on both screens. Just check that code matches. If it matches, you can then press continue on the old Mac. This may take a bit of time because uh, it depends on your file storage. On the new Mac, tell it what you want to transfer across, choose the options, and then set a new password. Confirm the password. Then press continue. Agree to terms and conditions. And then the transfer should begin. And then I'd go grab a cup of coffee or some cake. You'll see the progress bars on both machines. This may take a while depending on how many documents you have. And also if you look on the screen, you'll see how many megabytes a second it's transferring and how much it's done. And then once it's ready, you'll need to restart the computer. The old machine will say migration complete. Restart your new machine. And then it will transfer some more for a moment. And then it'll complete it. And once it's completed, press done. and then sign into the new iMac and all your files should be there. It may ask you to set up accessibility and IDs. You can set those up if you want to. And also sign in with your Apple ID to synchronize with your iCloud. If you don't want to do it right now, you can do it later. And also it'll ask you to set up Touch ID if you have the keyboard. I've set mine to skip, I'll do it later. And there we go. All our files have moved across and all our apps have installed. One thing I did find is moving from an Intel Mac to an M3, some of the software wouldn't work because it was using the old Intel version. So you need to go down to the manufacturer's website, say for instance, if it's LibreOffice and download the Apple Silicon version, install that over the old version, and then everything should run perfectly.